Golden State Warriors point guard Stephen Curry has announced that he will not participate in this year's three-point contest uh, during the All-Star uh, weekend. And um, this might be disappointing to some people, uh, even me. Uh, I don't like the Golden State Warriors. I've made that uh, emphatically clear. I hate that goddamn team. Uh, and I think Stephen Curry sometimes, especially last year, was overrated. But I do think that he's the greatest three-point shooter of all time. Some people are like, well, how is he overrated? And you just say he's the greatest three-point shooter of all time, nigga. I'm stupid. Because I don't think he's fucking Michael Jordan, okay? But I do think that he's the best three-point shooter I've ever seen. Uh, but he's given reasons why he won't do, um, won't participate this year. He said, quote, I've done it six times, I think. Uh, he's actually done it five times. I told myself I was going to do it until I won. And then I won. And then I had to defend. And then Clay beat me. So it's a little bit of an eternal battle. We're going to say, um. Uh, it's so much fun to be out there with the lights and the atmosphere, just you in the rim. But I put a lot of equity into that contest, and it's time to kind of move on. He also said, uh, but honestly, this All-Star weekend is kind of the slowest schedule-wise I've had, and I wanted to capitalize off that rest. So it was a tough decision because I love the spotlight of being out there shooting, competing and with the field and yourself. So, <clears throat> he will not be participating this year. I saw the uh, contestants that are out there, and I don't know. It's sort of like, you know, it's an adjustment. It, you know, I, I guess people that like the three-point contest and the fans of Curry will be sort of like, you know, 1989. You know, Michael wasn't part of the slam dunk contest. He never would rejoin it, even though Michael was seen as the, the Duke of Dunk or whatever, right? And then after a while, Dominique Wilkins stopped participating, I think after 1990. So it's like, I don't know. After a while, you got to get acclimated to seeing different faces, but it's fresh faces. And um, at the same time, though, it, it, it will create this perception that there's a false king. You know what I mean? Like, sort of like, after Larry Bird started having his injury issues and, you know, he stopped participating in all the uh, three-point contests, you know, a lot of people say things like, you know, well, Larry was the premier three-point shooter, you know. Even though his percentage might not have been the highest, you know, I think Bird would have beaten such and such in this contest. And you probably see something like that on a grander scale with uh, – people who win it from now on, if Curry chooses not to participate participate ever again in this contest, you know, for instance, if Clay were to win or in the repeat as champion or if a guy like Kyrie was to win, you know, you'll see people say, well, I think if Stefan had participated, he would have won or so whatever, you know, you see things like that, but tell me what you guys think.